exciting. So who do you have for first period? So I have that teacher that I had, oh my god, did you see Rob? His outfit is so cool and I think he made it himself. That is so awesome. I think I'm totally in love. And that backpack, I'm so impressed. It's amazing. Hey I, ladies. How's your first day of school again? <clears throat> Hey, all right then, I'll uh, catch up with you at lunch. First things first, get yourself an old men's jacket, the bigger the better. Start by detaching the sleeves at the seam, cut off the collar, and then remove any shoulder pads or stuffing that's gonna get in your way. Now to shape the bag. I want these two pockets to be on the front, so I'm gonna fold the appropriate length over, roughly four to five inches on each side. Now turn it inside out, line up your two pieces of fabric, measure and chalk out your sewing line. Then pin both sides together and sew down your chalk line. Make sure you leave a half inch seam allowance on your excess fabric and cut off the remainder. Fold those strips down and sew along both sides. Now to taper off the other sides, we're gonna flip it inside out again. Line up your new seam to the back seam of the jacket and pin along the bottom to keep it in place. To find the ends of the pockets so I don't cut into them, I just rub the chalk on to make an impression. Once visible, I drew a line up the side and pinned both sides together. I sewed a straight stitch to the top, then left a half inch seam allowance, cut off the excess fabric, and sewed down both remaining strips. Once I sewed the bottom closed, it was time to square it up. You square the fabric up by gathering up your corners and making a triangle. Pin together about an inch and a half down from the top, sew across, and cut off the excess. You now have the bottom half of your bag complete. Time to move to the top. Cut across the jacket right along the armpits to reveal the top of your bag. Shape your remaining fabric into a square. Now pin and hem down that front side of your bag. Pin down the coat lining to the jacket to secure it in place. And then pin down a double hem across the sides and the top. Hem it up on the sewing machine and you're off to the straps. This is where those two sleeves come into play. Make a small incision at the end of the sleeve and tear open, removing any lining or extra padding and lay it flat. Now fold it over wrong sides together and measure out some two to three inch wide strips of fabric from the top to the bottom. Pin both sides of fabric down right sides together. Now just sew down your line and cut them out. Flip them back right side out, hem the edges of your straps and chalk out where they need to go on your bag. This may take a couple times of trying it on and figuring out the right placement. Now pin them on and sew across them a couple times to strengthen your straps. Lastly, I trimmed down the front flap a bit, added some Velcro to the inside pocket to keep it closed, and threw a couple buttons on the front for fasteners. Topped it all off with a cool stencil, loaded it up, and headed back to school. Here on Threadbanger, we're giving away a brand new Janome sewing machine so that you can make your own damn clothing. That's right, and all you gotta do is upload a video telling us how much you want one, and you're on your way to a greener tomorrow. So after the show, check out Threadbanger.com for your chance to win. See you there! Hey Threadbanger, this is Tyler. Just wanted to show you some stuff that I made out of the fused plastic. I decided to fuse uh, together some bags. And I made this really cool messenger bag, and it has a little whale on it. You know, always gotta add some art to everything. It has a whale, and it's it, it's it's just huge, and I love it. And I just wanted to say thank you guys, and keep on doing what you do. Hey everyone! Just when you thought all the excitement was over, we have another huge announcement for you. Remember how we're having that whole Janome sewing machine contest where you have a chance to win a serger and a sewing machine? Well, we're not just giving away any old regular sewing machine. Nope. If you win, you'll be getting a brand new Threadbanger Janome machine. What? That's right, we have our own sewing machines. Knock, knock, knock! Special delivery from Janome! Holy... Oh my goodness! This is gonna blow your mind. You ready? You look at that. Huh? We asked to have our faces on them, but they said, you know what, guys, the logo is enough. <laughs> well, the good news is, if you don't win one of the show, you could buy your own. There's two models to choose from, and you could find out where to get them over on threadbanger.com. Or enter our contest to win one. Good luck, everybody, and have a good first day back at school. See ya.